Shankland made it 1-1 for Hearts and then Hearts got shanked and somehow ended up losing the match 5-1 against the Spurs Kiddies. Welcome back, guys, to Son of Scotland TV. It was Hearts versus Spurs. It finished at Tynecastle. Hearts won, Spurs 5. And I'm sure Celtic wish they were playing Spurs when they brought the Kiddies on in the second half. They would have knew how to deal with them, but we didn't, and uh, somehow we ended up losing 5-1. I don't really get it. I mean, Spurs, first half, good team out there. We only went 1-0 down. Second half, we made a couple of substitutes. Spurs basically changed their entire start in 11. They brought the kids on. We got an early goal through Lauren Shankland. And at this point, you're thinking, all right, it's 1-1. It's the upset's on. Spurs don't have the strongest team out there. But, uh, yeah, we could end up conceding four goals late in the second half. So, it is what it is. 5-1 uh, defeat. If you want to see my real thoughts, my true thoughts, the full reaction, then you can check out Fog Football. But I just want to say... I don't think it's time to panic. I mean, a lot of people are saying, oh, we've lost the opening two games. We've still had a good summer, you know. We've brought in a lot of decent players, or at least players that I'm hoping will be decent. So I'm not panicking. But yes, I, I would have preferred better friendly results than defeats against Leighton Orient and Spurs. But it is what it is. There's no shame in losing to Spurs, but perhaps there's a little bit of shame in losing 5-1 to Spurs. But here... As long as we win when it matters come the start of the season in the first competitive game against Rangers, that is all that truly matters. But yeah, disappointing. Nice to see Shankland get a goal. Not so nice though to see Spurs get five. Craig Gordon, may I add, only conceded one. Sander Clark conceded four. I know it's a friendly, but could this have any bearing on who's the heart's number one going forward? Last season, Sander Clark finished the season as the number one but who's to say he will begin the new season as number one we're gonna to have to wait and see but this game i don't think did craig gordon any harm he only conceded one goal against the heavy hitters for spurs and then when santa clark came on he conceded four goals against the the kids essentially so the young young so yeah not good for clark but we'll see what happens not good for hearts 5-1 it is what it is guys like i said you want to see my full reaction to the game check out fog football and uh yeah i'll probably have another fit it tomorrow definitely well daily fits guys but that, that's it disappointing at time castle is what it is if you paid 12.99 then maybe go and ask for a refund because it was not very good but like i said it's friendly these results don't matter as long as we win when they do matter as long as we beat rangers on the opening day every little thing is gonna be all right yeah, so hopefully it's going to be all right. Till next time, peace.